Kevin Hart is one of the most in-demand actors in Hollywood. Right now he's starring in the new movie Night School, which by the way was number one at the box office this weekend, and his irresponsible comedy tour is sold out. He is on fire. Yeah, he is, but he's never too busy to meet up with our Donna Oh, Durable. Donna, you lucky girl. As you know, you guys, Kevin is hilarious. Yes. He likes to joke about his size, Yes. but he really is larger than life, and to prove that, he partnered with Booking.com and welcomed me to his tiny house. <laughs> Tucked away in Herald Square, in the heart of New York City, is a tiny house reserved for a big personality. Kevin Hart teamed up with Booking.com to curate a smaller version of his humble abode in line with the trends. Hello! Hi, Kevin! Hi, Donna! How are you? Welcome. Nice to meet you. Welcome to my tiny house. Thank, Thank you for having me. And while the house was a mere 268 square feet, the amenities made it feel like home sweet home. Tiny houses are a big trend. They're a big trend, especially for people like myself that enjoy them. Why is that? Well, I'm a tiny individual. Yeah. I like my comfort to be where I can access everything the way I like to access everything. As you see, this is my like little lounge area. Yeah. Oh, I love this. You feel that? Yes. This is real Wolverine. People don't even know that you can buy Wolverine. Now, here's the real question. Do you think you could host a party in here? 100%. Yeah? Yeah. As long as you got space to dance, then you fine. Okay. Right here is where you want to be. You don't need more than this. You get doing all that crazy stuff. Now you bumping stuff. Can I take a step? Eating all that stuff. Okay. Did you wash your hands? Before you go I digging all in my candy. <laughs> That's a big thing with people go one your candy bit. and touch all your candy. Let me take these two out. I feel like you may have touched those too. I see that you have a lot of workout gear here, and I know yeah. that you have your own workout show, What right. the Fit. What motivated you to improve your physique so much? The reason why, because I do a lot. I'm on the road a lot of movie sets. I'm always snacking, eating all types of food, and I said, I'm not going to live long like this. I got to go and I got to get my healthy together. So once you step into it, you get addicted to it. You fall in love with it. For Kevin Hart, there's no excuse not to work out, even when you're in a tiny space. You go here, see that right there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you see, he said, ooh, because you feel it, right? Oh, yeah. Now you go out, that, that's good. That's, that's actually great. That's a great lunch. Look at that tiny space yeah. that you use right now. You don't need much. Nope, don't, you don't need, need much. much at all. You take this little small space. Here's a crunch here. Look at that. Ooh, no machine. Look at that. Ah, ah. Surrounded by some of his previous projects, Kevin was ready to dish on his current ones, movie Night School and the Irresponsible Comedy Tour. You're actually going from this tiny house to the big house across the street at MSG. Yes. And it's just you and a mic. How do you prep for a show like that? You know, you prep for that type of show by making sure that there is a high level of authenticity about what you're talking about. So through stand-up, I make sure that I put on the plate that I'm doing. And in honor of his new film, Night School, we played a round of yearbook superlatives on his front lawn. Of all the celebs you've worked with, who was the best laugh? Will Ferrell. Ooh. <laughs> Most likely to win the Nobel Peace Prize? Oh. Dwayne Rock Johnson. Ooh. Okay, who would be the class clown? Ice Cube. What about the most photogenic? Tiffany Haddish. Ooh, I like that. You know why? Why? She ready. <laughs> the big question. Yes. Will you invite me again one day? You know what? Because you were such a good guest. Because I can't prove if you touch the rest of my candy. You got another invite. That's a deal. <laughs> oh my God! I love him. It was so fun. And actually, Kevin's tiny house is now permanently available to book in Elizabethtown, Pennsylvania, at Tiny Estates, which is the world's <laughs> largest community of tiny homes. It's, it's a the trend. biggest of the, of the tinies, right? <laughs> by the way, isn't that fun that it he was, was so as nice fun. as you thought he would be? He was. Sometimes you show he can up be and you're not disappointed. Sure. He was hospitable. He was nice. Yeah. He was funny, charming, all of it. Good all, you girl. did a great job, Donna. By the way, Night School from our sister company, Universal, the number one movie, is in theaters right now. Mm.